I believe that imagination is stronger than knowledge, that math is more potent than history, that dreams are more powerful than facts, that hope always triumphs over experience, that laughter is the only cure for grief, and I believe that love is stronger than death. In the name of Allah, who is the creature of this entire existence, respected teachers and dear students, Assalamu alaikum. Today in this marvelous in, today in this marvelous gathering I am going to go, I am going to deliver my speech about who is responsible for declining the education system respect yourself in the declining of education system the students teachers and parents are equally responsible the student play no active role in the attainment of knowledge the entire education is passive and mechanical our education system is just creamy. The boys head with a lot of disjointed facts poured into the head as into the basket to be emptied out again in the examination room and the empty basket carried out again into the world. This is the reason the student who succeeds so well in his college examination so fails miserably in the examination of life. The students have no love of wisdom. Notors of knowledge, they only desire to get a certificate and diplomas to find a responsible job. There are many complaints about Kreta's primary school and the lack of quality education found in them. One of the main concerns is the lack of proper teaching, teacher training and teacher motivation. Teachers are not professional and the parents are also showing negligence in this regard. In view of foregoing defects and imperfection, our system of education calls for a change. One of the first and the most important talk is that we have to improve our educational machinery. We have to develop skills of education so that complete and harmonious improvement can be possible. We can improve our education system. If we adopt modern method for teaching, there should be commitment of the teachers with their profession. And the private educational institutions should play their active role. Education policies with complete check and balance should be implemented. Education system should provide not mere book arms and job enters, but intelligent citizens. Lastly, I want to conclude my speech with this quotation. Education is the passport to the future. That education is the passport to the future. Tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today. Thanks for listening to my work.